Kirchhoff's law or Kirchhoff, I don't know how to pronounce it honestly, is linked to conservation of some quantities. Which quantities do they link to? Kirchhoff or Kirchhoff's first law is to deal with current. They said the current flowing into a junction must be equal to the sum, algebraic sum of currents flowing out. So if this is 3 amps, this is 1 amp and 2 amp. Why is that so? Because charge must be conserved. Charge. If you have a certain amount of charge going in, you must have the certain amount of charge going out. So charge is the first one that they're talking about. Not energy. Second law, huh? Momentum? Excuse me? Where on earth does momentum come from? That is a completely different topic. Kirchhoff or Kirchhoff is to do with electricity and we don't talk about momentum in electricity. Like, uh, uh yeah, ne ne never mind, never mind. <laughs> so, what is the second law about? Sec Kirchhoff's, this is K1. Kirchhoff's second law is talking about potential drops. It's like this. If you take an elevator up to the second floor and then you take the stairs down, you should be at the same height. It's the same thing, lah, okay? But in different words, in circuit, they are saying if you go up a battery and then you drop and you come back to the same point here, okay? This is what we call a rise. You increase in potential battery. If the battery is 6 volt, you rise 6 volts. Then when you come to a resistor or whatever component, if that's the only component, then you will drop by 6 volts. And if you come back to the same loop, you're back to start. Okay, if, you, if this is your zero, you go up by six, you come out at six. So that's what it means. And that is because energy has to be conserved. Energy comes in, energy goes out. What energy is here must be spent. So that is energy, second law. This is wrong. Okay, so that's all for this question. Make sure you know the two laws. You need to know their definitions too, because sometimes they will ask you in paper one and paper two. That is all for this question. I will see you in the next one.